welcome back to our channel and thank you once again for joining us in this another day in the life of living on the autistic edge i am terry and elaine proud autism mom and we are here to share with you tips and tricks of how we navigate through our journey right here on the autistic edge today we'll be talking about the benefits of planting seeds for our children on the spectrum We can get sensory stimulation. The, what planting seeds does, it engages the sense of touch as they can help improve the sensory processing and the sensory integration for our children. And the touch there, when they have to handle the soil and the tools and all the different textures involved in the seed planting, that is good for sensory stimulation for our children on the spectrum. It also helps with developing fine motor skills because the handling of the seeds because these seeds are very small the handling of the seeds it requires some amount of precision in picking up these smaller seeds filling the little pots or the little pockets with soil watering the plants so these activities contribute to the development of the eye and hand coordination and the fine motor skills Planting seeds also creates a routine for our children. It helps to provide a daily structure. So this activity, it offers a sequence of steps. So from planting to growing or caring for the plants. So this creates a routine so the children will know that, hey, you have something to do every morning. We're gonna water the plants. All right, the seed planting also help them to develop responsibility and patience so caring for the plants require an ongoing attention and it also requires patience in watching them grow and this will help them to develop a sense of responsibility when they have to care for something over a period of time another benefit is that they learn about nature so while growing these plants or planting these seeds you can use this opportunity to talk about nature you can use this opportunity to talk about the the cycle of plants and the importance of sunlight the importance of water the role of the soil and of course they get a hands-on experience here when they have to do this kind of exercise now another benefit is language and communication so because because they will have to talk about the the cycle and we engage them so as you realize while alex and i were doing this activity i would tell him what we were planting so of course he gets an opportunity to learn a word and to learn something so he will know about tomato he'll know about pepper and he's able to pronounce them so here it's bringing out their language so again we are also seeing speech therapy coming about in the planting of seeds and by the interaction that you are having with the child it is also a stress reducing activity gardening on a whole is a calming and enjoyable activity and even adults they love gardening a lot of people tell you they love to plant they take pride into their planting activities so it does provide a sense of calm and enjoyable and this will help to reduce anxiety with our children and some of the children on the spectrum like Alex Xavier he enjoys the out of doors so gardening is something that of course he will surely love all right social interaction is another one so if it's a group activity that they are doing whether they're you know whether it's at school or it is at home it provides an opportunity for collaboration and they will be able to work together and this improves their social interaction last but not least watching a seed transform into a plant caring for it watching it grow it provides a sense of pride and accomplishment and this is not only for children it is also for adults as well but it is very beneficial for our children to be engaging in these activities so guess what parents 
incorporate your child into some gardening activities and see how well they reduce their anxiety and see what improvements you get from them all right now alex will be planting some peppers and tomato so these will be hot peppers and tomato stay right there we will be right back today we'll be planting seeds today we'll be planting seeds seeds this one is Tom Mario. Tomato, good boy. Pepper, what is this? Pepper. Pepper. All right, so we'll be planting tomato. Alex loves tomato, right? Especially when they're big and juicy. Yes, this is soil. This is soil. All right, so we're going to give you some more soil. Hold it properly. Good boy. Good. We're gonna put some more in these, all right? Good boy. How many check sections we have? One. Mm -hmm. Two. Yeah. Three. Four. Mm -hmm. Five. Five. Six. six. We have six sections. So we are going to Three of them we are gonna put tomato and three we're gonna put pepper. 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 Okay. So you don't need a lot, Alex. I don't want more than two pepper seeds in one bowl. Two. Put it in the first one. Good. Good boy. Cook these and put it in this one. good all right that's it for the pepper three more seeds three pick them up put them in this one nice see another one here we just put it right there so good boy and then we have one more so yes pick up the three put it in this yes very good no more than two or three seeds to a hole okay Okay. We don't want to have too much. All right, so you're gonna put a little bit more soil just to barely cover the top of it. Huh? And this, all right, not too much, not too much. Little on this. Beautiful. Right, you're gonna cover your seeds. You're covering the seeds. You're covering the seeds. seeds. All right. Now, this is going to be your little watering can for the season. Okay. okay so you're gonna water it so we're gonna take it off the stand yes next beautiful alex next wow all right we want to label them alex so we know which is which right one put it right down good let it go right so this is the Alex will be nurturing these for the next two weeks and we are going to show you what it looks like when they start turning into seedlings. Alright, so Alex, this is going to be your project for the next few months. We are going to be growing tomatoes and pepper. Pepper. Tomato and pepper. Pepper. Alright, so we are going to keep this close to us so that we can watch the germination in the morning and we will keep you posted as to what is happening with this project once again thank you so much for joining us in this another day in the life of living on the artistic edge don't forget to like comment share and make sure you subscribe so the next time we put out another content you will be notified